Messiah College playing host to three different games on homecoming Saturday, October 19th. The Falcons field hockey team would get things started on Anderson Field as they would host Lebanon Valley College in a matchup of two undefeated teams in the Commonwealth Conference. The Dutchmen would only collect two shots in the first half, but that first one would be good for a goal as they would go up 1-0 in the third minute. Messiah would have to wait to the 41st minute when Mariah Pouts puts in the equalizer. And then just two minutes later, Pouts would again get into the circle, but would lose the ball. Brooks Sands would run on to the shot to put the Falcons up 2-1 as they would go on to win 2-1 over the Dutchmen, moving to 5-0 in the Commonwealth. Up next for the Falcons, it would be men's and women's soccer, hosting Stevenson University in doubleheader. The women entered the game at 3-0 in the Commonwealth and were unbeaten in their last 10 games. In the 22nd minute, Macaulay Soto would get a cross from Emily Schneider to put the Falcons up 1-0. Allie Rogers would follow soon after as the Falcons would go up 2-0 in the first half. They would outshoot the Mustangs 11-0 before the intermission. That was Rogers' first goal on the season. And Marisa Weaver would get her second goal on the season later to put the Falcons up 4-0 after Kryn Wolf scored. They'd go on to win 4-0 over Stevenson, setting up this matchup with the men over the Mustangs. The men, like the women, also 3-0 in the Commonwealth, looking to move to 4-0. And early in the going, Josh Wood would put the Falcons up 1-0 with his 13th goal of the season, setting off a celebration from the almost 4,000 fans in attendance for this homecoming day. That's 4,000 fans in attendance at the beginning of the game because the heavy rains would come, but the Falcons' offense would stay relentless. They'd go up 2-0 in the first half as Mike Kovac would collect his fifth goal of the season following up this shot from Jeremy Payne. The Falcons would take that 2-0 lead into the second half where Jack Thompson would get his fourth goal of the season to put the Falcons up 4-0. The Falcons would go on to outshoot the Mustangs 22-1 in the game. The Mustangs only shot coming in the second half, but the Falcons would be strongly in control. They'd go on to win 5-0. A PK goal by Josh Wood put him up 4-0. And here Ryan Lago gets his first goal of the season as the Falcons complete the shutout, winning on homecoming day to move to 14-1 overall. 4-0 in the Commonwealth Conference. Perhaps an even more memorable win for the Falcons as before the game they did honor the legacy of former men's soccer coach Leighton Shoemaker and displayed their new alternate kits for the first time in program history. Be sure to follow all the Falcons action on GoMessiah.com.